G'day guys, my name's Josh, you can call me Joe Woodle, and welcome back to 7 Days, where I'm about as happy as I've ever been playing this game. We are back in the Australian Overhaul mod, Outback Roadies, and after yesterday's absolute horn swoggle, if that's even the right words to use, this is probably not, this absolute ridiculous find yesterday, the tier 6 M60, I'm just all sorts of fizzy. I'm about as bubbly as a shaken up bottle of coke. I'm feeling top bloody notch. So to celebrate, I've got Nancy, I've got Brian. We're finally using the hot tub of my mansion as the moon sets and the sun rises. In fact, I think Great I chucked into you. you. Did I chuck into you? I did chuck into you. Daddy's even got some beers for us. Daddy's even brought the frost. Nancy, here you go. There's one for you. Brian, here's one for you too. Listen, we've got to celebrate this stuff in style. In fact, I'm going to need one as well. So everyone, please. I mean, it's been early for a beer, but whatever. Take off your pants and jackets. Good morning, everyone. Froths up. Coughs up. We're ready to go. I'll put those remaining frothies back into DD. Because, you know, well, listen, I gave a froth to everyone else. DD can have one too. She's been by my side, fluttering by my side for a little while. I am firing on all cylinders today. I'm just feeling absolutely peachy. <laughs> I'm, I've had a pearl of an afternoon. I'm ready to crack on and do it all again. Another whole bunch of casings in you. I did change over. I'm making some extra 762 ammo, but I'm actually going to pump out almost a thousand rounds of 9 mil. Do have those turrets I have to account for as well, and the horde base I have to account for. But I think everything here is pretty much hunky dory. So I'm going to, even though I drank a bit, I'm still a little bit thirsty. Follow it up with a coffee. That's a bit cheeky. But I'm going to get back in the gyro and fly back out to the wasteland. Got one more day to find another T6 M60 or a T6 SMG. So I'm hopeful. I'm dreaming. I'm ambitious. And I'm... Oh, skimming the snow, but good at flying again. It's not a crash unless you hit the ground. And I very nearly didn't. Oh, jeez. Thank goodness the fog's at least a little bit lighter this morning. Otherwise, I probably would have careened directly into the side of that mountain. I, why is there a mountain range there? Where, oh, it was the, it's the big pit. Ah, 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 oh, my God. We're okay. We're okay. We're okay. I almost pinned it directly into the great Australian bite. Australia took a bite out of me. Oh. <laughs> Every time. Every time. Why am I like this? Take my fingers, because I, I I do do the um the oh, I've, I've got a head rush now. I've got all gooey. Um the the gyric of the trick where you hold shift W C and spacebar all at the same time, basically like doing that with my finger or fingers, even it's more than one, to fly wherever I need to, barely using any fuel. That's why the gyric of the runs nice and quiet, but it means that every time I take my hands off that to open the map or whatever. Like, E is right next to W. Whose fucking bright idea was that to put the fucking yank yourself out of the sky and try to turn yourself into a puddle of muck on the ground button right next to the go generally forward button? Put it somewhere else. Make me hold it for more than a second. I'll look at the bloody key and I'll throw myself out the bloody emergency exit. We're out of the winter, finally. Thankfully, I can now see where I'm going without having to potentially kill myself by opening up the map. Okay, we are coming in hot and hard and heavy and very bloody spicy. Still running from the high of yesterday and now thrown potentially into the ocean of regrets. Yeah, it's gonna be it's gonna, it's gonna be a, a long day, but a good day and hopefully an exciting day. One more day to get the weapons I need. Just me, DD, Nance, and Bryza. Although I left I left Nance and Bryza in the hot tub. I let I I frothed them up. I gave them booze. I left them alone in a hot tub while I go off gallivanting around the wasteland. I feel like I'm going to come back to a little mini nurse or a little mini baker when I get home again, but that's okay. Look, it's hot night tomorrow night. If they need to, like, do some things to work some things out of their system or at least just enjoy some of the more visceral pleasures of the world before we get eaten by demons tomorrow, so be it. So be it. They've earned it. They've earned a little time off. Or in their case, pants off. It looks like I might get very lucky with this, and I might actually... You know what? I'm going to park her up on the highway over here so I have someone to take off again. Weave through the trees. That's actually not too bad, you know? That's not that. That was some cherry ripe flying right there. That was so good. It was basically a violet crumble. Uh, I'm just going to get on the hoof 
out to you. There might be landmines, but it's just me. I've left my friends back at home to canoodle. So if I kick a mine, it's not going to explode anyway. Very lucky. Very lucky on that one. Oh! Less lucky on that one, though. Yeah, nah, I'm aware, DD. Thank you for that one. Jeez. <laughs> I forgot there's still some small spiders out here. All right. What's in the drop? Anything good? A tier six chainsaw. Dude, I've been fighting, fighting so many tier six things out here. It's wild. Yeah, nah, look. Look, I would have loved for, for my bride and my Nancy to come and join me. Come on a big adventure out into the middle of nowhere with me. But instead, they're just staying at home to... <laughs> Go on a different adventure. Choose those words very, very carefully. Okay, so I'm all the way out in the west. There is Broom. So that's Perth all the way down there. I think Broom is actually somewhere just down here. I'm going to quickly just kind of clip the outside of this desert here to get some less fog to see what I'm doing. Pull on back on the joystick so I get a little bit of time to suss it out. Not seeing an awful lot because the buildings just aren't rendering it. I turned in a lot of settings so that I could actually run the game at something better than three frames a second in big cities and that's one of the things that it's cost me. All right, we're going to go probably old school, but a little bit more daring school, Top Gun school. Fly low, fly fast and see what we can see. There's got to be a shock of a siren here somewhere. Somewhere, anywhere, anything you got for me. It's not looking that promising, is it? Like, I'm doing laps. I'm going all over the bloody place and finding not a lot to speak of. There's a cathedral. I could go and pray for an M60, I suppose. There's a Bob's Boars. There's a little shotgun messiah there. No, I, I need a big one. I, oh, oh, oh. I need a big one, I say. And then just like someone heard me, it has been delivered. Land on the road. Pretty bloody nicely. Actually, take back off into the city. Oh, my God. Fucking seriously? There's a goddamn demon guarding... <sighs> guarding the shotgun messiah? God damn it. God damn it. All right, well... Uh, the spider head's easier to hit. So you can cop that one. I'm going to quickly, very bravely run away. Oh, that's a... Yeah, no, I just, oh, okay, I've got some problems. I've got some problems. I just wanted to get away from him because that's a much bigger issue than the Arlene and the ScoMo and a Rad Arm. Drop you. Uh-oh, I think he knows where I am. I think he knows where I am. ScoMo. And a goddamn demo as well. Holy shit. Holy shit. The Wasteland knows. The Wasteland knows that I got the t six. Are you fucking right? Who did that? Who tickled titties? You can't be doing that, though. Now he's burned down the bloody shotgun messiah. They know what I'm here for. They know why I'm here for. Oh, get over the fence. Over the fence. Holy shit. That's a big bloody spider. Big enough to ride to work. You're a tiger kangaroo and took eight legs instead. Oh, and you're waving goodbye as well. Can't believe you're trying to burn down my loo already. Didn't even get in there yet. I can see through the gap that there's... I mean, there's someone glowing up on the hay bales there. I'm going to have to deal with you later on anyway, so may as well just try and draw you out. One through the foot, one through the knee. I will not make the joke. Oh, but he will make a joke of my aiming, though. Come on, Nackers. Yeah, you're fine. Why don't we just go with the SMG, because you do have the anti rat on you. Do the same for that one. And then while you guys are charging, just get a little bit of distance. Go back to the... Oh! Oh, you clever boy. Go back to the knuckles for the regulars. You've... <laughs> oh, you've gone for a snack. What are you... What are you even eating, mate? Oh, there's a wolf over here. Nope. Yeah, no snacks for you. No snacks for me. We can share some breakfast tomorrow, but... <laughs> it is going to be hard night after all. You need to die. There we go. There we go. I'm still miffed about this. I can't believe you blew it up. <laughs> I just got here. There's more fire. Why is everything on fire? All right, well, listen. That's enough faffing about with the locals. I need to get in, get through, and get whatever loot I can as quickly as I can. Oh, you weren't there last time. That was very, very lazy and very, very complacent of me. It didn't even close the door on the way through. I can hear something. I just don't want fire this time. Last time I lost loot to fire. This oh, it's so dark. That's I can see your eyes. It's so dark without my NVGs or my helmet light on. 
If I lose another box to, uh, to fly, though, I'm going to be so bloody upset. I've left all the loot inside for the moment just to come and see... Nah, everyone from the firing range is already dead and probably fair enough, too. Oh. A time and a place to gobble a noodle, mate, but now it's probably not it. I do like that zombies try to, like, get snacks whenever they can, but it is definitely a rather disconcerting noise to hear every now and again. There's another one just out there. Oh, I can make that shot. I can make that shot. Up. Ah. Could have, but he wasn't there anymore. I just shot it. I winged it. It didn't bloody work. Didn't even loot the ute on the way through either. I'm get. I'm all over the place. I'm just... I'm tired now. I'd have been so excited yesterday. Gee, that's really going, isn't it? After being so excited yesterday, now having to focus again. Not, um... Ooh, there's a mine right there, too. It's just not really up my avenue, hey. Oh! 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 Oh, what? I didn't even consider that being an option. I... Well, if I was fucked up before, I'm going to be absolutely topsy-turvy now. Another T6 M60 in a random ammo pile? I was, I was, I was miles away. I was absolutely miles away. I was thinking, oh yeah, I'll just grab this ammo. I'll get ready to take on the big battle in a second. I've got a fucking great feeling about this, DD. What are you talking about? Well, I think someone's going to come through the door over there, but I do not give four fifths of a shit. I was like, I was just thinking about like what was coming up. I was getting back in here, do the looting I needed to, and you shout out a tier six M60 at me again. And you're the slightly better one as well. Well, get you out of the way, get the brand spanker back in again. That is obscene. That is obscenely good luck for me. Make sure you're loaded up with the AP rounds. So I've got the best of both. The best of both. I'm rolling AP on one tier six. I'm rolling regular on the other tier six. Oh, all, all I need now is the tier six SMG. And I might just go have a lie down. After all that shit outside. Oh, that's so good. Oh, I've been rewarded for my muppetry. Well, that'll serve me right for this express nitro rating. Just like opening up things. And I, I, I perceive to have very little value. And just tapping R immediately. And not even giving it the time of day. It is, uh, it has caught my attention and then some. What a day. What a day to be a wound or what a day to be a me. <laughs> it's bloody 10 o'clock in the morning. Bonds are mate level up. I'm going to put you straight into Lucky Luna because why not see if we can find that, uh, that SMG as well. When I tell you, points be damned, I'm already a very Lucky Luna. I've got the head rush again. The head rush, that I, the same one I got yesterday when I found the other T6M60. I've got that one going again. It's making all my thoughts very bloody fuzzy. I cannot believe that. I cannot believe that's not only that I found one, but that's how I found it in a random ammo pile. It's gonna be a, it's gonna be a week before this spoil even begins to fade, let alone disappears. Grab the shotgun messiah box up in the rafters for a pistol peep book and some pistol parts. Thank you. Now I don't actually have any lockpicks on me because I brought some time charges. I don't normally roll with these, but we'll give them a go. And I think it's like, is it two that I need to get into a gun safe? There's one. Boop 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 boop. There's two. Probably should have opened that door ahead of time, but that's okay. Pop, you open. Beautiful. Untouched immediately. Probably should have just gone one at a time, but that still works. I'm feeling confident. I'm feeling brash. Listen, I'm on top of the world right now. On top of the bleeding world. Not a lot could bring me down. Although, gods of seven days, that is absolutely not a challenge. Please don't. Just going to whack all the governs that I've found so far straight into deeds. You've got all the extra pocket space and just the perfect... All right, perfect amount of pocket space. I did ditch some random gums back there. Is it just... Oh, hey, guys. <laughs> Is it just you two? There's no Nance to hop the fence like it's bloody the sand lot and go take on both of you. You're not even close to being the Hercules I know and love. Boop you. You know, you're trying to climb your friend. Now's not the time. Ow! Now's not the time for that. I can't... Okay, listen, I was going to say, if you don't die quickly, I'm just going to start shooting things. I need that loot. I need that loot, and I need it to not get destroyed this time. I'm not so worried about, like, the big boy box, just like the shotgun messiah boxes. Do I charge straight over there, or... 
to watch. Oh, but there's gonna be so many cops and things. I reckon. I reckon I get straight into it. Straight into it. I pop the boxes, do the looting, then deal with the consequences. I can come back and pop you open later. Or could I even? How good's my stealth? Oh. There's some random mups in here. You're gone. Is my stealth good enough to get to the boxes? Just don't run. Don't run. Oh, I've got chlamydia though. It's making me very visible. Too late. Too late. They're all coming. They're all coming. Open them up. One after the other. Shut my box. Don't care. Just grab and go. Nothing good. Nothing good so far. Grab the ammo as well. Oh, so there was something in there. That was just some knuckle parts. Okay. Okay. After that, after that little priority <laughs> issue, now I can start dealing with the rest of the zombies. We're good. We're good. We're fine. Let's charge them down. M60 is great and range is not. Dude, that's actually worked out really well. That's actually worked out really well. No cop. My bad. Turns out the coppers aren't the problem. It's definitely me. That's fine, though. That's not where the loot is. I burned down the watchtower. We're fine. We're all good. I'll change over to maybe the um the AP in a second. We'll just get some distance. 14 more rounds. Let's don't do anything done. We've got the upper hand. We're all good. We've got plenty of space, plenty of time, and plenty of ammo. Oh, I was using it. That's why I exploded the body tower. I got confused between my two T6 M60s. Must be nice. What a luxury it is. I was using AP ammo. Not regular ammo. No wonder I bloody exploded shit. I'm not going to take the chance this time. Just rinse them from over the fence. Gone. Are we clear? I reckon we're probably mostly clear now. I'm going to just finish it off with the knuckles. Good. I did hear a grumble from someone else. There might be one more left over somewhere out here. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you're trapped. Trapped behind your own barricades. We're good. Look at that. We're done. That was a much better way to do it. Is it just a... Is it just an Outback Roadies thing that all these... All these uh, ammo pallets are lootable? It's been... It's been a little while since I played completely vanilla seven days and I've forgotten what may or may not be normal. I think it might be a mod thing. I think it might be a mod thing because you can break these down, I think, for iron, but you can't loot them like that. I definitely prefer being able to loot them. It makes more sense to open up crates of ammo and find ammo. It's not particularly overpowered either. There's probably some extras around you. Look, because they're everywhere. They're everywhere. Because, look, it's not giving me heaps. A little four-time scope mod, not too bloody shabby. Maybe I'll just keep looting them. Keep bloody looting them. I haven't got back to, like, the main loot box yet. The scavenging. Scavenging everything. All right, that'll do us. Everything else is done. There's also explosives around, so I should probably leave sometime soon. Does this, like... Does this have a chance to set fire to things? It is an explosion, after all. That is one thing I didn't consider. It does. Thank God I've already looted it all then. You still have a little bit of yakka to go. Heaps of yakka. These time charges, they're really good in the Undead Legacy, I remember being, but they're, they're not really that great in vanilla. Still another one. Probably could have finished off with the pickaxe, but that'll do. Three time charges. Change it back again. Boop. Hardened chest with some T6 thighs. I absolutely have some T6 thighs. Thanks for noticing. Which are the same as what I'm currently wearing. I mean, listen. Listen, I, I came here and I found my T6 M60. Whatever you gave me at the end, I was still going to be stoked with. Thank you very much. I'm going to go. I'm going to go take back to the skies again. Oh, it's just after midday too. What a good day this has been already. I'm struggling to see anything else around here. There's a cracker book. There's a broken down factory. I mean, unless it's got like a nice big neon sign, I'm not going to see a sausage from up here. I don't even know where I've gone. I don't even know where I've flown anymore. And I'm too scared to touch the map key because I will throw myself out of the gyro again. I think I came from this direction originally, though. That's the high school. Ooh, I'm also flying. Ooh. Flying pretty quickly. That's a trader. Ah, look. Look, I'd like to come say good day to you, but I'm not sure it's going to give me what I'm after. You're going to sell me a T6M60. Should I go through that? I was talking about how the checkpoints do have like that military aspect to them. I reckon I do. I reckon I do. I'm going to leave you there. You're going to jump back in here. You just jump out to use the brakes and then swing you around. 
Ah, oh, ScoMo. Ah, ScoMo. Don't even bother, mate. This isn't the same one that's not quite as big as the uh, as the one that I raided at the end of demos only. Oh, I was going to say, I heard a spider. Oh, I see a spider. If you want to take a little bit of a step to your left and then jump not too far to your right, oh, I will put some bullets into you. That'll do. Because you're also a pretty big boy. I'm pretty sure bullets do penetrate... They do penetrate those, uh, those chain link fences. I mean, I can only tell where you were because your dangly legs were poking through. We're good, though. Clear out the outside. It's not as big as the other one I've been to. So I should be able to get through here nice and... <laughs> nice and quickly. We got a wormy. Oh, you still got one limb. Can I... Can, hang on, hang on. No, I didn't want you to die. I just wanted you to be a nubbin. I wanted to turn you into a thimble of a zombie. Damn it. I want to get into this police car, but I don't have lockpicks. Does... Does this work? I guess we'll find out. Might burn some things down, but... No sirens. It's also still not unlocked. You can't even... You can't even blow the doors off a car. I hate the time charges. I hate the time charges so much. Are you even close? <laughs> Dude, that is some dog water damage you were doing. I've got another option though. If this does get the siren, oh for goodness sake, if this gets the siren going off, I'm gonna be pretty, pretty bloody stiff. Four time charges now. I hate this game. I hate this game. Did you actually spawn everything in, or did the knockout is me breaking it? I don't think it spawned everything in. I don't <laughs> but even so, even so, you're taking the piss. Or, I guess no one just anticipated someone to be stupid enough to try and explode their way into a calm. <laughs> Clearly, they never accounted for me. I didn't even check, but it is a tier 4 POI. So that makes it a tier 6 with the wasteland bonus. Oh, I can't, I can't see one behind here. I just don't want to... Shit! I was going to say, I don't want to ruin my stealth, but I guess I will if I absolutely have to. Uh, oh, no. I was going to go to the AP. I was going to go to the AP to shoot through the shower curtain, but you beat me to the punch. Oh, man. These M60s are really good. I very rarely roll assault rifles, so having a couple of M60s is a rare treat, and I quite like them. And for most weapons in this game, though, when you... Jesus, when you're completely maxed out on them, you do do a fair amount of damage pretty quickly with... All except the sun button, which is worthless. No matter what you do, it's always worthless. I can see someone through the gurney, I think, but I don't think I can shoot an arrow through there. Can I... Is that your foot? Can I afford that? Is it? Can, can I afford your feet, or is it free feet in 2024? That was two. That was two. All right, well, that works. You want to come out and say hello to me? I've got two fists for you. Oh, I've, I've, I've razzled though. I've rattled you up. Fix you up. Sounds like there's a lot more coming. Might go... Nah, don't. Be brave. Be brave. You're fine. Just use your knuckles. You're spectacular for a reason. Use your bloody boomerangs. Look at that. See, they're so good. They're so good. Tier 6 boomerangs. We're almost completely clapped though. We get that SMG. We have everything being tier 6 and... Oh, shit. I was going to say, I can't imagine anything much better than that. But you know what's better than that? Having no giant spiders trying to eat you. It's a tough shot, but there's definitely... Oh, an Arlene there. Probably helps if I have some ammo loaded. Arls. I think I might have clipped the table on that one, actually. I was going to get I was gonna get pissy about the hitboxes, but I think I might have actually just shanked it. How about take a far, far easier shot instead? This is Arlene, after all. Easy is the name of the game. Bonds, mate. Level 99. Got a skill point to spend. Another one. Nice. I was going to say, is there any other, any other friends in, in here of yours, Arlene? There was always a couple. Huh? Take it over. I can out of you. I'm still trying to, like, play this as smartly as possible. I was going guns a blazing, but I'm running out of time. Damn it. So at some point soon, I might have to blaze those guns. 420. Drop blow. I will say, this does seem... Relatively low, I, 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 a simple, small for a tier four. You're right. There you go. For a tier four POI, definitely feel like I've seen bigger ones and worse ones through a lot more other places. A, a, a spider there that I'm very much trying to hit. 
Before I worry too much about the zombies, spiders are definitely scarier than zombies. Trust me, I'm Australian. I'm the authority on the matter. Are you? You were stuck inside. AP ammo got it done though. Is there more around? Make sure all my guns are loaded then. Oh, there's, there's a snake. Oh, there's a snake. There's probably some badges around here somewhere too then. Any coffees? Oh, for goodness sake. I don't care if the world ends. Put a fresh pot on. There's no, like, loot area. I've gone around the entire outskirts of the checkpoint and I didn't find any actual loot. So there's nothing in the caravan. Nothing in the tents at all. Oh, doggos. I clearly haven't been everywhere in here yet. I have not been everywhere, man. That's a gun safe. Oh. 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 Is there like a... Oh, there's going to be a massive underground at this place, isn't there? I was just talking about how I felt this place was way smaller than other tier 4s. Probably because it's not all above ground there, champion. Well done for picking up on that slice of nuggets. Shit. All right. Definitely got the early crow going then. Um. Oh. I found the loot! I found the loot! I found the loot! I shot open a door and all the zombies got mad at me! That's a lot of zombie boys. That's a lot of zombie soldiers. All mates tried to flank me. Cool tactics. Guns still work better. Are we good? Is it just you guys? Maybe it's not underground. Maybe it's not underground. It's just a big fuck off tent of nah in the middle. Holy. That almost got very bad. Oh my god, it's got worse. Holy shit, it just got worse. AP ammo. Don't even take any chances with the big boys. Didn't drop any loot for me either. It just, it kicked off to 100 so quickly. Gonna pop open this gun safe. Please don't burn the building down. Still need a second one. It took four to get into a cop car. I think it's only two to get into you though. Unless it was at the last shock of Messiah joints. Untouched. T6 Shetty. Lots of T6 things these days. Uh, before I loot you, I do just want to have... Have a little look, Harley. Not the time, love. You're definitely gone. Thank you. Always wait for the XP, Pop. What are you? Oh. Just, <laughs> you have all that security for your frothies? I mean, shit, you got to protect what's important to you, but, ugh, nah, bourbon, throw it in the fire. If it was any other kind of whiskey, absolutely. I've looted everything else in the tent. This might be my last bastion of hope to get my tier six SMG. Look, it'd be nice, but I feel like I've already come out ahead and then some T6 Knuckles with everything that I found both today and yesterday. Some repair kits, some fuel, some paper. Uh, I'll read you. Got a, not a lot of room left over. I've got stacks and stacks of ammo out of this too. That can go, that can go, that can go. Do I have duct tape on me right now? I'm not sure that I do, but I do have some glue, so can't make duct tape anyway. Pursue off and turn that into a frame. All right, that'll do us. That'll give us some nice little space. Beautiful. Wasn't even the bloody medical equipment that I was looting either. Read that. Take the rest. Savage country. For not a lot. I gotta, I gotta explode this thing again. We'll go one. And we'll go two. Boop, 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 boop. In you go. I don't think I'd actually need the distance, but it sets fire to things, so probably a good call. Damn it. <laughs> Just let me in. Let me into your T6 SMG hotness. Not that kind of hotness. A different kind of hotness. Untouched. <sighs> if only. If only. Some lockpicks, some cash, some more T6 thighs. That's three sets of T6 thighs i got around me. What a dream come true. <laughs> I'm drowning in thighs. How good. That's probably going to do us in the end, I think. That's probably going to do us. I heard... I did him. Not a putty cap, but a spider. Could we sit you down? Just a little one, so that's all good. It's sort of the size of my foot, so it's basically, I don't know, it's like a little house pet. But that's going to do us for the wasteland, I think, because it's now 8 o'clock. Oh, that's a nosedive. And I do have, excuse me, bear. I do have some things I need to do all the way back home. So point, point your nose back towards the east and pin the throttle. Goodbye, Wasteland. You were exceptionally good to me this time around. I appreciate the tier 6 weaponry you gave me. 
I'm, I, you know what? I'm not miffed at all. I've done very, very well for myself. I'm all smiles. It's, uh, it's a weird feeling. It's slightly melancholy. Like, yeah, it's a gorgeous sunset, though. I mean, I'm, it's, the environment's definitely making me feel things before I was ready to, but it's like saying goodbye to the wasteland for this week and potentially this mod is a weird feeling because I don't know... I, you know, I usually make series until day 49, seven weeks and seven days to die. Makes a lot of sense, seems to track out pretty nicely. Plus, I mean, obviously at the end game, but I, I don't know when 1.0, like the new alpha, the new update, the new release for seven days is coming out sometime this month. So I don't know if I have time to continue this at all, but leaving the wasteland always kind of makes me feel a little bit weird. But I think it's just leaving anything for the last time makes me feel weird. I get weirdly attached to everything. It's like, you know, getting a pencil, calling him Bob and snapping him in half like in community makes me feel something inside. At least I know I can feel something inside before the fog comes back again. God damn, I hate the fog. It's going to be another one of those patented, woodle, foggy, sketchy landings. I've just put a marker where I think the helipad is on the map. Didn't want to spend too much time there because I threw myself out of my gyro again. Wouldn't be a woodle series unless I, acc oh, until I accidentally pressed E. And I'm, oh, I'm coming in quick soon. I've just kind of like beelined it uh, for where I thought it was. Fuck, I'm amazing at this. That is smack dab in the middle. That's fucking phenomenal. That is absolutely incredible. Turns out when I don't have Nance and Brian yapping in my ear to distract me, I'm actually a fucking amazing pilot. Oi, you two, do you, oh, do you have your clothes on? This is YouTube. This is, if I come around that corner, you've got all sorts of bits and bobs hanging out. We're all going to be in trouble. Are you, are you okay? Are you decent? Incoming oh! Enemies, oh contact. God, it's incoming something. I don't think it's enemies. Who's out here making a problem? I'll give you guys a moment to put your clothes back on and quickly go and... Oh my god! Defend our house! Holy shit! Bud, you missed the boat! The ravenous stuff's upstairs! Night time's finally fallen, but I'm safe back at home. Uh, you can all go into there, all go into them. I just want to make sure I've got everything in order before I do anything too silly. I did bring home... If I can modify you, take those guys out of you. Thank you very much. Where was actually that M60? You've got some mods in you I want to take out as well. I could go to the traders in the morning and just buy some extra stuff. But I feel like it's just kind of a waste of time at this point. I'm probably better off. Definitely better off. Just focusing on getting my horde base sorted. So you're... You are the better one. You're the better one. So that means you can get chucked away into the sellables box. Mods go into you. That was a very lucrative trip, wasn't it? We've done very well out of that. I'm... Oh, I'm feeling good, which is a dangerous thing to be feeling in 7S. It never ends well. I think everything's good. I'll make sure that Nance and Brian are decent again. You good? Yeah, now nah, you guys are good. You've holstered your weapons, so you can now follow me. At least I know that you've had a bath after all that nonsense. Come on, then. Come back inside through my lovely bedroom. Pass the purple chair. Don't you touch it. And all the way through the other side. I'll take both of you. That's a good amount of steel that I'd very much like to keep on smelting. A whole bunch of that, please. Uh, no, uh, come on, fat fingers. There you go. Another 87. I'm still smelting more again. Now it's the iron problem again. Go, go like you, all pretty much even. What do you need? You need 20 minutes of fuel, so I'll just get that at least done. Nice. That's all good. Do I just crank the rest of this into... Probably AP, I reckon. Probably AP. Seven boxes of AP. Eight boxes of nine mil. Or eight boxes of regular. Just go to the AP. Just go to the AP. Why not? So if it, it's the most amount of damage possible. If I end up using that at the end, I'll be all right. I think I'm in... Can I everyone? <laughs> Did you ever walk into a room and feel like everyone was talking about you? Well, that's how I just felt then. I feel like I'm in about as good a position now... As I can ever really be. I've got ammo. I've got most of a base. I just need to do the last little bits of upkeep. Fix up those pylons. Get it all nice and smooth. Maybe even like just stealify a whole bunch more. But I've got all morning to focus on that. I've nothing else to worry about. We are all good. All gravy. All looking sweet. So I'll have to leave this episode here. And come back and face the day 49. Insane nightmare. Max level zombie. And demon. And spider. And kangaroo. And fucking whatever else horde. In the next episode. Because this episode is done.
fun. So thank you guys for watching. Most of all, thank you to the page of the Patreon who made this episode possible. If you like to make sure you hit the like button down below and subscribe to this channel. Follow me on Twitter. If I don't talk to you there first, I'll see you in the next episode. Have a good one.